Oh, what are we doing? They're massive. Huge, like, yeah. This one is like, I'm like, buzzing. Yeah, <laughs> let's just go big, let's go big. And I'm sitting there going, I have to drive it. Good morning guys, so we're coming to you from a very sunny Bristol this morning. Kind of feels like spring has finally arrived, doesn't it? It's just take, taken absolutely forever. Like we got back in April and we thought, oh, you know, we'll get back to the UK in April, weather will be good, but no, um, it's taken a bit, a bit longer this year, hasn't it? So anyway, enough of the weather. So we are here in Bristol. We're at a lovely place called the Daisy Paddock. It's only like 10 pound a night, which is perfect for us. Big field, loads of space. Don't know if you can see behind me there, but big field, loads of space for the kids to run around and nice and quiet too, which is what we like. Not really a campsite vibe, just a field vibe, which uh, works for us. So yeah, the kids have been playing football out here. This morning, we're actually trying to be a bit more productive. So we need a bit more routine in our lives, we've decided. We're getting up too late. We never know when we're gonna do the schoolwork. So we're starting something new this week. Richard is getting us up at like half past six every morning. We're going to be cracking on with the schoolwork, doing like even a little lesson before we even do breakfast. So the kids are loving that and getting them dressed straight away. So we're starting to be a bit more productive and we're hoping it will make our days feel a little bit better. And then in the afternoons or like late mornings, we should be done and we can just chill out and get on with some other things for the rest of the day. So this morning, Rick did like a, a lesson on uh, continents of the world with the kids. That was really nice. But you think we use BBC Bite Size for that. So that's a good one to look at, have like a little lesson plan on there quiz at the end uh, really good sort of actually for structuring lessons and then I've been outside with them doing some arts and crafts so we did it with Ted I did it with Teddy to start with so sometimes he feels a little bit left out when it comes to sort of the schoolwork he's obviously only two so doesn't need to do as much so we made a, a fly-in uh, pterodactyl with him and then we all sat down and did some volcano work so we had to make our own felt volcano which is now hanging in the van so that was all good fun Let's go, we're out of here. to somewhere very exciting granted Ted doesn't look very excited but it is somewhere very exciting so before we tell you where we're going we'll give you a little bit of an update about our lorry plans yeah and what's happening on that front so I've got my theory test my C1 theory test next week next Thursday so I did a little bit of revision this morning got a good score on my multiple choice but failed at my hazard perception but I think that's because it's faulty it is you said, I pressed the screen, I pressed the screen. Yeah, I noticed the hazards before it even noticed the hazards itself. Yeah, apparently it's too quick, too quick for the tech. Yes. That's what you're saying. Absolutely. <laughs> That's definitely what I'm saying. Yeah, no, so I need a bit of revision on that to do. Um, but yeah, we're, we're getting there. We should, the C1, once the theory's done, uh, it should be, I don't know, hopefully a couple of weeks after yeah. to do the practical, we yeah. hope. We're hoping it won't be much longer. We're hoping you pass. That's that's the plan A that you pass the theory. Yeah. If if I don't, I'm not telling. You. Yeah, that'll be embarrassing, <laughs> won't it? But that's the plan. Pass the theory this week and then book the actual test yeah. for as soon as possible. So that's what's happening there. So today we are going to a really cool place. Well, we're sat in traffic at the minute. Yeah, we're sat in traffic, but we will get there. We're going to go uh, to a place where we can go and view lots of different lorries which is really exciting because we've not really been inside one not like an empty one um, so that's really exciting we'll actually get a, a real good feel of what the space is going to be like because rick's getting a little bit concerned that maybe this lorry will be too big but i'm yeah, like all so the space the better they've got the box we're looking at is a 20 foot box so it's like six meter box but they do have a van there and i vico daily uh, with a 15.5 foot box which is like 4.7 meters so that'll be interesting to see what that's like yeah we'll see mm. i'm happy to go big i think we need the space yes because you're not driving well yeah obviously <laughs> but we'll see we'll go and look at these lorries and we'll show you guys um what we find it's going to be fun
Rick missed our junction. So we just happened to turn around. But to be fair, for a big van world, the actual access is very, very small. So It doesn't seem like <laughs> there's any big trucks there, which Don't might say be, that. Uh... Don't say that. This could be disastrous. We might have to end the vlog right here. Sorry, guys. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Catch you next week. <laughs> So we've arrived at Big Van World and we've just been in to speak to someone who's going to now show us a couple of their big vans, big uh, seven and a half ton lorries. So it should be good to get inside. Inside? It's really cool. Yeah. So what were you saying about the shutter? Yeah, so apparently the tail lifts like this. Yeah. Are part of the chassis. Okay. So you won't, you can see the right, number yeah. plate is actually on the tail lift, so yeah. you won't be able to take that off. But this is, is a separate unit. Yeah. So with this, we should just be able to unbolt it. Okay. Uh, okay. Just get, get it off. Yeah. Same with there. Okay, there we go. That's enormous. You can literally put my van, <laughs> our van, current van, in this van. <laughs> <laughs> you could, yeah, you could drive straight in, yeah. couldn't you? <laughs> yeah, what right. you have? Oh, yeah, come on, should we all go in? Yeah, let's all go in, if it will take us all. If it will take us all, yeah. All right, hold hands, hands yeah. back, yeah. This wouldn't be enough space. I can't even hear you. <laughs> yeah, okay, cool. Oh, 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 it's okay. What's that? Top level. That's yeah, the door that opens up. What do you think to the space? Yeah, the space works, isn't it? Yeah. So the 15 foot, this is. Is it, this yeah. is what this is 20 foot, 15 foot, 20 feet, sort of about here. Do you know if that's enough space? No, no, I think we need this. I think this is like. This is a lot. Yeah. No, this, this is nice. Well, this will work, won't it? Shoot. Yeah. Right. Come on in. Back on the lift. So, what do you think, Jack? You tell me. You tell everyone what you think. We want a lorry. Did you like it? What did you think of the inside? Good. Yeah. I'm going to make loving beds. Lovely sofa. Lovely books. Also, lovely kitchen. <laughs> and a table to sit on. So all together. <laughs> cool. What it is cool. Do you think we'll have enough space in that? Definitely. I think. That was awesome. That was really, really cool. They're massive. Huge, like, yeah. This one is like, I'm like, buzzing. Yeah, let's just go big, let's go big. And I'm sitting there going, I have to drive it. Yeah, but to be fair, when you went inside, you were like, oh yeah, this is cool. It's huge. Yeah. It's like a mansion. Yeah. It's like a mansion on wheels. It's a mansion for us anyway. Yeah. It is absolutely whopping. <laughs> to be fair, like I've never been this excited about a house we're buying. <laughs> no, that's true, yeah. <laughs> but no, I am, a lorry. <laughs> I'm a little bit concerned about the cab cut through cut we're going to have yeah. to do to the yeah. habitation body so if anyone out there has any knowledge yeah or any knowledge with horse boxes as well because they have that cut through let us know in the comments because oh, i'm getting a little bit nervous about that yeah but that was cool people have done it people do it so the plan is to have the cut through and obviously the kids yeah. will well all of them or two of them will be in the back as well so yeah. that's obviously why another reason we want the cut through so we can actually still see and hear our kids while mm -hmm. thinking about it you know it could be good without yeah. the cut through it could be it could be <laughs> Food for food yeah, no, for. it's all very exciting stuff. All right, then, guys. So we've just had a quick pit stop here at the Cotswolds uh, water park, and so we've just come back from seeing these trucks. And 
and well, what do you think? I think he says trucks. It's not truck. It's a lorry. It's I use truck. They're the same. I truck know. and a lorry is. The I same. know, but truck doesn't really give the truck same life. the same vibe. It's lorry life. Mate. Lorry life. I'm not going to be a trucker. No, you're a lorry. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to have the one. I'm going to have my, this arm is going to be tanned and this arm not. Yeah. And it's sticking out the window. <laughs> It'll be joining yeah. that club. Yeah. And get, I'm going to get myself a set of braces. <laughs> Perfect. I look wicked. Please don't yeah. do that. <laughs> So we went into their yard at the back and they had about eight or so dafts, didn't they? Mm -hmm. um, all lined up. My first thought was they're not too big. Uh, yeah, and then I went into the back of it and it was huge. It was massive. Like, they are big. <laughs> well, what are we doing? But big in like a really Well, don't good hold way. my hand to reassure <laughs> like, me that this, okay, is, <laughs> this is fine. This, is, this thing is huge. <laughs> Do you know what though? I think it is what we need for like full time, permanent life on the road. We need that space. Go big or go home. Right? That's it, there's five of us and we're gonna be living in there, we're gonna be working in there, schooling in there. We need something where it's like on a rainy day, we aren't gonna pull each other's hair out. Yeah, it's no, it's, yeah. Like it, it, it's a big truck and I look forward to doing the conversion. So we're definitely gonna go ahead with a seven and a half ton lorry. The only thing that um, I'm concerned about is the cut through because we need there's three seats in the front cab we then need to cut through from the cab into the main body the box on the back mm -hmm. and install two seat belts now they do this with horse lorries they do this with race trucks for you know people that do motor racing and stuff like that and so i don't see any reason why we can't do it with this however the chap did say because i asked a question does the cab move independently to the box and he said there's a hydraulic movement involved um and i need to find a bit more about this out yeah. just how it works yeah. we're not really sure yet how it actually works. i don't want to we don't want to be going down this road and then realize we can't put seats in the back yeah yeah that'd then, be disastrous yeah, we're left with a lorry that we can't live in potentially. yeah i could be a bachelor oh god <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't last like I a day huh? <laughs> <laughs> we're about because you wouldn't. You really wouldn't. Huh? No. Yes, I would. No, it wouldn't. We, we, that's not happening. Huh? Don't, don't try and make that happen. I don't know. If you think I should become a bachelor, then please put it in the comments below. Might be good. No, I'm only joking. <laughs> I'm only joking. You know, need someone to make the tea. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I Cookie cooked the dinner. tea last night. It's dinner. Don't say tea. Tea, dinner. Let's have a little debate now. It's dinner, isn't it? It's not tea. It is actually dinner. It's I don't dinner. know why I said tea. Yeah. We could yeah. lose a lot of people right now who are going to say, it's tea, not dinner. Yeah, that's it. All the northerners are saying, oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Goodbye. Anyway, we're going off feast. Things should start moving quite quickly now. And we're obviously going to record from the very start. So stick around subscribe hit that notification bell let us know any comments yeah next that you've week got. next week you're going to find out if he's passed or failed his theory test so no, that'll be quite no. interesting you, you'll find out if i've passed my theory test if i fail i ain't telling <laughs> no i ain't saying nothing anyway yeah. put your good luck vibes in the comments that might help yeah absolutely yeah. but until next time guys thank you for watching subscribe as we say and we'll check you next week see you later no i just, I just shot everyone <laughs> <laughs>